Right, and to take it a step further, I've integrated my interaction system with this project, uh, which I have a full tutorial series on, by the way, if you want to follow it, uh, to show you what it's going to look like when integrated into an actual game. So here I have a shopkeeper with three items in front of him, and I have the option to steal one of these items, um, or I have the option to pay him. So let's see what this looks like uh, when integrated into a game mechanic. So now I'm going to steal one of these items. Shopkeeper gets angry, and shopkeeper starts chasing me. So then I can say, like, okay, fine, I'm going to pay the shopkeeper. <laughs> <laughs> shopkeeper happy, shopkeeper goes back. So this is basically how you would use something like this. Now you can imagine this doesn't have to be interacting or stealing or paying. It can be anything really that happens in-game. But for now, this is the use case I went with. And you can think of how to use this in your game, come up with a bunch of use cases, expand on the system further. In general, just make it work with whatever you're trying to do. But this is the foundation that you will need to get this working.